ओके गाइस इफ यू आर हैविंग अ टेरा बॉक्स लॉग इन प्रॉब्लम गिव अ लुक एट फ्यू सॉल्यूशंस आई होप वन द अदर सॉल्यूशन विल हेल्प यू सो द फर्स्ट थिंग दैट यू कैन ट्राई इज यू कैन ओपन द सीएमडी ओपन सीएमडी एज एन एडमिनिस्ट्रेटर इन योर पीसी and you're going to type p i n g ping terabox.com just give a few seconds and you're going to see packet sent 4 packet received also 4 that means server connection is fine the terabox uh, server is not down so this must not be the problem if server is down you'll have to wait that is uh, not your fault the terabox itself has to got to fix this now the next solution next reason why you are not being able to log into the terabox app is the second thing you can do is you can use the vpn so you can open the play store or whichever store you have in your phone you can just uh, use the vpn so what vpn does is is try it to help you to connect to the different server over there in the different location so you can just uh, try connecting your phone to the different server in the different location you can see there are number of uh, free vpns so you can go with the free vpns or the premium one you can get any one So, if free VPN do not work for you, you can try the premium one. So, install any one of the free VPN, and let me show you how you gonna check it for TeraWorks. Once it is installed, so just uh, I have installed this uh, randomly in order to show you how it works. So, you just have to connect your phone or PC to the VPN. You can see here are the number of location. You can choose the different location and try to connect uh, your uh, phone or the PC to the different server in the different location, and then you just try to log into the TeraBox. So this is the second thing that you're gonna try. See if you are able to log into your TeraBox app. So the next thing that you can try is here is the TeraBox application. You're gonna just long tap it. and go to app info so another way to access this is if you don't have this feature in your phone go to settings you can go to somewhere you're going to search for applications is the apps is the manage apps on the top you're going to search for terabox if you have installed it is the terabox you can tap it and here it is so the couple of thing that you're going to do is first is stop the application you can just clear the case if you want you can just also clear the data and you can just check it if your phone is working fine this phone will be now like a newly installed and just try to log into the terabox application i hope it help you can do the same even in your pc if you have the problem in your pc so this was the next thing that you could try it still do not work come back to the same place what you're going to do is here's the app permissions is already allowed is the other permissions also here you're going to see is a couple of permission allowed that is really necessary here's when to change wifi connectivity you can just allow it so what it does is turn wifi on or off so whenever it wants it can turn your wifi on and off so you can check your wifi connectivity whether it's uh, on and off even manually Now you're gonna just uh, try to log into your TeraBox applications. So it's not that mandatory. Even you can just uh, check your Wi-Fi is on and on and off manually. Still, you can allow and check it if you are able to log into your TeraBox uh, applications. So this was the couple of things that you can try. Let me see what you can do next. So, so next thing is one more thing that you can try over here. you can just uninstall the application 
click on OK to uninstall and then reinstall from your App Store and just try to log into your application and see if it is working fine. You are able to log into your Terabox applications. So these were the three things that you can try over here. What else to try? Sometimes just uh, reboot your phone. You can just reboot your phone and you can check it if it is working fine. And just try to log into your Terabox applications. Sometimes just clear the keys and cookies of your phone. You can just go somewhere or you can just uh, install that uh, clearing cleaner applications. You can do the security scans and any functionality issue in your phone. So all these things you can do in order to uh, see if it's uh, working fine. You can see able to log into your Terabox applications. What else you can try is um, if you are not being able to log into your Terabox applications, uh, you can just uh, check your network connection. See if your phone is over the Wi-Fi and your Wi-Fi is uh, router is working fine. Check your other PC and other phones where the net is working fine. Try to browse it. Your browser, net is working, internet is working fine and your phone is properly connected. So this is the, uh, another thing that you can just try if you're you not being able to log into your Terabox applications. So one more thing that you can look into is see if any update is available and update your Terabox application to the latest version. You can go to the store from wherever you have installed and see if the latest version is available. So all these things that you can try if you are not being able to log into your Terabox application. Have a nice day.